This is the third Slothcast. I'm Smitty. Over here's Mr. Nope. Over here we have Snatch Rover. <laughs> that one's stuck. Snatch Rover, or as I like to call her, Little Timmy Toes. Timmy Toes. <laughs> we have D, our residential feminist lesbian, and then we have Badge Patch Adams. Who's oh, made it? Uh, <laughs> Mr. Nope and Badge Patch, the only names have not changed. I really thought about being Little Shithead McGinnis today, or Papa Dude Shit Caller. Papa Dude <laughs> Shit Caller? <laughs> That's what I'll be for the next one. Papa Dude Shit Caller. I want to put that on forms. Like, name, Papa Dude Shit Caller. So if I went that way, that way you want from the form. No, I want, him to, I want him to lean that way. Yeah. Fuck him. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> I don't even know. I'll leave you to do Look, all set, You got to speak louder. You got to speak louder. You, no, he was like, I'm going to lean into you. You're face. <laughs> shit. Shit, I walked right into the You should just have to lean into your face. <laughs> I right Open the door and walked in. Yeah. <laughs> well, you opened the door, walked in, and then slammed the door in your own face. So, the topic <laughs> for today is since we couldn't think of one good topic, we took two mediocre topics and put them together because that's what we do. <laughs> make it a super mediocre topic? <laughs> to super a vaguely mediocre. acceptable topic? A vaguely acceptable set of topics, vaguely mediocre, like Taylor's life. For all of our five <laughs> listeners, which is us five in the room. Yeah, damn right. Uh, I haven't listened to <laughs> No, go to hell. Go to hell. <laughs> I know what happened in the court. I haven't listened yeah, to you. I don't know well, we, My we, life is not mediocre, but you know. You, you know. No, your life is like an episode of Special Victims <laughs> Unit. That's right. Fuck <laughs> you, Chris. Fuck <laughs> you. She, she, she just stands by the door like, come on, Mariska. All of us are based on true stories. Yeah. We're going to say they're fiction. Yeah. <laughs> I see narrating everything. Yeah. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> <laughs> I used to be the cop killer and now I'm cop number four. <laughs> yeah, now, now I'm the black cop on NBC. Yeah. <laughs> and isn't this funny? <laughs> Ice T has that list, but everybody yeah. took his ass serious. Yeah, nobody can take it serious with a list now. No. Perez Hilton's got a list, but I just. <laughs> <laughs> Every time I hear it, you're a fucking ass team, man. Yeah. Like, they want whatever the fuck you want. Yeah, pretty much. He's like, I'm Ice T. <laughs> <laughs> I hope to God he doesn't oh kill us. <laughs> That's like Ice Cube. Everything I think of Ice Cube, I think, man, my drink is warm. <laughs> my drink is warm. My drink is warm. Oh. Anyway, the topic is would you rather's and life's important questions. And I do have one, I feel one of life's important questions is why is the sleep in between snooze buttons the best sleep you'll ever get? Fuck. <laughs> Have you noticed that? I hit snooze, and for that nine minutes or whatever, because yeah. my iPhone is nine minutes. Yeah. yeah. So in that nine minutes, I'll have dreams about riding a unicorn with assault rifles. <laughs> yeah. Fucking cheeseburger every second. You're fucking. Yeah. Yeah. You're fucking, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> fucking Jessica Alba. <laughs> you know, and Anne Hathaway's watching all pervy. You know, and I'm like, uh, and the unicorn that I'm riding with the assault rifles is on the back of a shark, which is strapped to the back of a velociraptor. After and we're going through a Taco Bell drive through <laughs> <laughs> That's the greatest nine minutes of your life. Listening, <laughs> listening to We Are the World. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> if it was saying, <laughs> it was saying by Lil Wayne and Elton John. <laughs> <laughs> we are the world. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> it's like that whole scenario just said it on set for once. Blue is fucking high. <laughs> <laughs> How does it feel, Mr. Nope? How does it feel? To what? <laughs> Did you say twat or to what? I thought you said it's a lot. <laughs> it's a lot. It's a, that is a this, lot to take. This is why, this is why we should record without him knowing we're recording. <laughs> yeah. Because he tries to be cool when we're recording. Yeah. Well, you go fuck yourself. <laughs> I did, dude. Like, right before Taylor got oh, here. Oh, fuck. Yeah, I mean, that's a gift. I was just like, eh. <laughs> I'm pretty sure when I called you, you just got through watching, watching like, glory hole in the corner. <laughs> yeah. oh, when, when you called Seth, he had just got done watching, like, Backdoor Asian 7. <laughs> Backdoor <laughs> Asian 7. <laughs> It was like Backdoor Agent 7, tight fit squad. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, who's hey, Seth, where you at? Uh, 
I'm all, I'm all the way there. I'm all, yeah, I'm all the way there right now. His there pants, his pants are down around his ankles. <laughs> he's just fucking standing in the middle. Okay. Fucking uh, standing there. I, here's another important question. Okay. Do you find it morally acceptable to watch porn? I think it's fine. Yeah. I don't think any problem. As, you know, as yeah. long as you know you're not watching kitty shit. Yeah, as long as you're not watching like disturbing shit, like yeah. like you know, kitty porn or bestiality or what I imagine Seth makes in his basement when the woods are right now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You know that only, think about all how big the internet is. Think about how big the internet is and how much porn there is on the internet. Statistically, only 4% of the internet is porn. You're shitting me. 4%. I just read this earlier this week. 4% of the internet is porn. Yeah. And think about how much porn there is. And what was it? Like Jesus so many, fuck. like, like, 50 or 60 percent of people use the internet for porn. Yeah. So. And like, it's like, oh god, it was some astronomical number doing it at work. Yeah. <laughs> and like, I'm not, I never, I mean, I, I don't imagine that I would want to sit in there in my office or whatever and click on, you know, porn and watch it. I mean, I, I'm, that's for after work. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I mean, unless you're, unless you're me. Like on third shift, dude, I'll just pull up nasty shit. Oh, well, on my oh, iPhone. Oh, just yeah. like, hey, there's a video of two chicks getting, you know, fucked by a Saudi Arabian sheik. Let's play this while I'm checking out, people. Oh, my <laughs> <Yeah>. God. Praise <laughs> Allah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, hey, Seth. Yes. Would you rather have sex with your parents or watch your parents have sex? What ifs, man? What ifs? Yeah. Make it harder. Would you, rather, would you rather have sex? Would you rather laugh and watch your parents have sex for all eternity, or join in once to make it stop? <laughs> oh fuck! Yeah. That's, oh, that's terrible. No, even. And it's it's uh, one way or the other. You gotta choose. And it's like oh, you got oh, you got oh, a glass. Oh. It's like in one eye, one eye. You <laughs> got a lens. You got a lens in one eye. Your whole life watching your parents have sex. Your whole life. <laughs> so you got a chance to like end hell for you, you know? Because I couldn't do it. You couldn't do it. No. So you would rather stay in hell for all eternity watching your parents have sex. What about you? What about me? Your parents too. Your parents too. Shut up. No. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you. I'm bad. <laughs> <laughs> I'm bad. Patch Adams. It doesn't matter. I don't He's have bad. Patch Adams. I don't have parents. <laughs> Bullshit. <laughs> I don't have parents. He's like, until it's tax time. <laughs> I support their ass. <laughs> They're not their ass. They're not ass. They're my dependents. Yeah. <laughs> They're my dependents. They are old. Oh. I wish that's how it worked. I'd have claimed him a long time ago. I would have claimed dad. I would have like, claimed your fucking dad, too. Pretty <laughs> <laughs> much anybody I know could have claimed dad. <laughs> like, I'd have claimed Danny. Bigger shit, I'd have claimed you. Uh, they would be like, "Can you claim her? She's mainly handicapped." I'd have claimed him. Fuck, as much money as I gave that bastard. <laughs> <laughs> I need money to get tickets for uh for Bitch, uh, don't even start. What was, it? what was it? What was it? What was it? What was it? Was it? it was a tool concert. Tool, tool concert. Tool. And I'm like, yes, yes, tool. Yeah, you know, you want to oh, see them. Oh, this awesome. is coming from the guy who's. Oh God, I can't afford rent. Here you go, Jeremy. Oh, I pay my rent. Dude. Bullshit! I pay. Hey, I gave rent. you all. He may have had to hook on the street. I pay my <laughs> rent. No, he did. I pay my rent. Yeah, when I put it, put the check in your no, fucking what, checking what account. What pissed me off, man, was that you took that money without even saying anything, and then you go off and you buy a fucking iPhone 4S. <laughs> <laughs> you did you do that? <laughs> It's the, I mean, if you had just said, "Hey, look, can we're you not shut going, up so we can get back to our talk?" We're on the we're on the Every talking. time I've ever been around you guys, you bitch about money. Dude, <laughs> go fuck yourself. Go fuck yourself. I'm tired of you bringing it up. So, so Taylor, the question is: Would you rather no, 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 bitch no, no, no. about money, okay. or be kidnapped by the Slender Man? Slender Man, <laughs> Slender Man, hands down, hands down, the Slender Man. I love it when guys are taller than me. That's why I like the Slender Man. <laughs> He's looking at my window right now. Yeah, he's he's outside. Outside. man. He's outside. <laughs> he ain't got a face. Why are you looking like <laughs> that's my That's my new face face. No, that's that's my face. face. I can imagine Slender Man as a child. Tiny Slender Man. Maybe. <laughs> Tiny <laughs> Slender Man. Maybe Slender Man. I thought he could be Slender Man. And child. He's a chubby man. No, 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 man. no, he's still Slender. That's what makes him creepy. <laughs> Oh man, skinny kids are weird. <laughs> skinny kids are weird shit. Yeah, they, they, look, they look like fucking Holocaust victims. You're like, you're like feed that baby. Oh my god, you just want to take it to the McDonald's drive-thru and get it a Big Mac. 
<laughs> Feed that baby. <laughs> Feed that. That's like everybody tried to say that uh, that one chick's baby was mine. Listen. What? Baby. You what? didn't hear about that? What? Story? That's a long story. One of the women we used to work with, uh, uh, sister-in-law, was having a baby, and they tried to say it was mine. You know how that fucking song is a ringtone, and just pull your phone out and be like, <laughs> "That baby ain't mine." <laughs> <laughs> but they tried to say it was mine. I said, "Listen, if that's my baby, when it comes out, you're gonna have to shape it to see what the gender is." <laughs> If that baby comes out with no hair, it ain't fucking my baby. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. What do you think the meaning of life is? 46. I was thinking 42. 42. Yeah. 42. 46. Five. 46. I just changed it. 46 is a new meaning of life. <laughs> 46 is a new number of life. A new numeral. I don't get it. <laughs> You've never seen Hitchhiker's Guide? No, I haven't. I'm sorry. They asked the machine, you know, what the what the meaning of life is and they go away for years and after all these years of the machine talking about it they come back and says the meaning of life is 42. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> Taylor's like I haven't read that book you son of a bitch <laughs> you just ruined that 20 year old novel for me. Spoilers! <laughs> oh, God. I forgot there's spoilers. Yeah. I forgot. People are bitching about Lord of the Rings spoilers now. Though. Lord of the Rings spoilers? Yes. Lord of the Rings has been around since like 19... Well, The Hobbit's been around since 1937. Yeah. So... <laughs> they're, they're bitching about Hobbit and Lord of the Rings spoilers. And it's like, really, guys? Really? 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 That's like somebody going, you know, Bruce Willis was dead at the end of Sixth Sense. Oh, shit, no. <laughs> and did you know? <laughs> Look at Seth, he's like, what? It's like, oh, Bruce Willis? <laughs> Fuck! Why did I do it? I like Bruce Willis, but I'm tired of Die Hard. I oh, fucking fuck hate Bruce you. Willis. I fucking hate Bruce Willis. You just, he's fucking summoned it. Now he's just going to burst through a window and punch her in the face. I, like, I hope I, he does. I like Bruce Willis in movies that aren't Die Hard. <laughs> like, I just you can't know, believe you don't like Die Hard. Like Unbreakable, Looper, didn't things, you, good stuff. Didn't you tell me I was un-American because I didn't care for Die Hard? Yeah, and he's clearly a Canadian, though. When you don't like Well, I was looking at this little stuffed lumberjack, so I might be Canadian. Uh, when you say to me, when you look at me, and you say, Papa Do, <laughs> I do not like Die Hard, I immediately assume you're from another country. Like, That's true. And I, you know, he now has a French accent every time he talks now, and I just immediately look lay in I front of him. I'm stupid, I'm out of con. I'm lay Jeremy Bonnet. I'm Jeremy Bonnet. I'm lay. I will drink my wine. <laughs> <laughs> Look at me in my Coca-Cola, my American champagne. <laughs> Go okay, on, on. So does that make you Canadian? Yes. Do you even like Bruce Willis at all? Fuck no. Is it a lesbian thing? Oh, maybe it's his bald head. I'm not sure. Yeah, because like, <laughs> you know, what's head. funny is... Bitch, I got daddy issues. They ain't got a butt chin. I don't like them. <laughs> Bruce Willis has got sort of a butt chin. Nah. Yeah, he does. Yeah, he does. Bruce Willis, like Bruce Willis probably carries around a shotgun on a regular basis. Fuck him. Fuck him. I don't like him. Oh. Fuck him. You are never welcome in my home. <laughs> <laughs> Next time she comes... I'm going to McDonald's to record the shit. Yeah. Yeah. My time it's all said and done. Next time she comes over, I'm going to have Bruce Willis play it on every TV. In the <laughs> oh, and then we got one. Then we got one. The other one is a fucking... That's a fucking phone in there. That ain't even a fucking TV. That's a fucking cell phone. It's like an iPad. Hello? <laughs> Please, I'm tricky. Help me. You just need to, do, need to edit that picture. Uh, Jeff Goldblum was watching you poop. Yeah. Like Bruce Willis. What? Bruce. You never heard and seen that? What? It's That's a picture that they post way? everywhere. Uh, and it's a picture of Jeff Goldblum. But it also says Jeff Goldblum is watching you poop. Yeah. It was Jeff Goldblum from the fly where he's like... <laughs> no. And it just said Jeff Goldblum is watching you poop. We had our bathroom at Mom's for like months. She just never bothered to take it down. Yeah, she goes, <laughs> she go, guys, I'm really getting creeped out by Jeff Goldblum. It's <laughs> too bad, huh? It's too bad while I find it comforting. Oh, God. I'm going to put it on the hand towel thing at work. So, Chris, Chris, what's yeah. the meaning of life to you? The meaning of life? Yeah. I think that, uh, <coughs> uh, you know, I've never really thought about it, but it's either one of two things. A full collection of Beatles albums or try to be happy. Yeah. And I don't think they equal each other. I think that if you go that far, far, far to find Beatles albums, you're a sad you motherfucker. <laughs> far. <laughs> far. Far. You go that far, shut up, lesbian. Far. <laughs> you ain't like Bruce Willis. I'm editing you out of this shit. Fuck Bruce Willis. <laughs> it's like you, it's like you. <laughs> Fuck Bruce Willis. I'm going to make that my text. Don't Fuck Bruce Willis. Fuck <laughs> Bruce Willis. <laughs> no, no, me <laughs> Oh, God. Oh, my God. <laughs> Chris Todd, I have a song for you to hear. You have a song for me? Uh, you got text talk. I got to figure out what I the thought, song I thought was. it was like a... 
Like an <laughs> anagram got a text um, done. <laughs> you said dumb dumb did it. I mean, we think dumb dumb did it. Go on, I have to figure out what it is. I know what the meaning of life is. What's the meaning of life? Your hat. My hat is the meaning of life. Yes. It makes you happy. Or, or that scarf I saw on FYE yesterday that f- matches my fucking TARDIS hat. Won't you roll the hipster truck back a little bit here? Roll the hipster truck back. No. It's a fucking hipster semi and it's going full force. It's like, a hipster. Forward. I noticed your pant legs were rolled up and you told me you drank the tea before it was cool and that's why your tongue was swollen. <laughs> <laughs> Oh man! Oh, oh man. God! So, so you're gonna go all hipster on us now? Ah! No. Are you gonna go on some anti Bruce Willis hipster shit? No. Like, so, what is, what, I want a diehard scarf. What's the time about a scarf? It's fucking winter, I dude. Scarfs are warm. I don't know why. You, you, know you, you know what? You know what? I don't know. I don't like Bruce Willis. It has to be a hat. I just fucking don't like Bruce Willis. You know? You know what you should do? There's no reason. Have you ever seen a picture of Bruce Willis's actual daughter? Rumor. Yeah. Yeah. Bitch's name is Rumor. Bitch's name, name is, is Rumor Willis. Well, she's there's a picture of her, right? Really and awesome. she's got, yeah, and it's her cleavage is showing. But if you think about it real hard, those could just be Bruce Willis's heads. Because oh, <laughs> yeah, yeah, she pulls off her bra and it's like you see Bruce Willis's face on his skin. <laughs> <laughs> ah! Surprise! <laughs> What are you doing with my daughter's tits? <laughs> what are you doing with all your daughter's tits? <laughs> That's irrelevant. Yeah, literally. <laughs> you see that hard? Taylor's like, no. <laughs> Fuck you, Bruce Willis. Fuck you. You ain't touching this match. Fuck you. You're not, there ain't even going to be a rumor of you touching this match. <laughs> oh, 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 fist fight with Bruce Willis or fist fight with Chuck Norris? Fist fight with... Chuck Norris. You think you could win against Chuck Norris? No, but he can't use his legs, so I'm safe. <laughs> <laughs> yes! <laughs> of everything you said, that oh, is that's that's brilliant. brilliant. That is amazing. <laughs> and it got all quiet. We were all like, Sam, yeah. <laughs> like, I, almost, I wish we were on video for that. Because <laughs> we all just... <laughs> oh! <laughs> Oh, that's that's something that needs to be preserved for posterity. Yeah, like just the look on his face, like I'm safe because he can't use his foot. <laughs> just that moment of brilliance. That, it's like Einstein relativity. That's <laughs> those moments is why you're here. Yeah, I, I mean, goddamn, they're rare. I don't know what happened to the past two podcasts. Nine nine times out of a hundred, you ain't worth shit. <laughs> but that one just time, like you make life. up for it. Just just <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, pony! Whoa, I'm so real close to you today, Seth. You might. Yes. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's because of your man boobies. <laughs> she I just work hard for them. She just, right. If you walk into Walmart and you go, just real quiet, bitches be like, what? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she is the Mufasa t- uh, of snatches. <laughs> like you say, Taylor, and they're still like, ooh. <laughs> 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 so that's gonna get the one be like. <laughs> Yeah, it's gonna be like if Taylor turns it down, it can't be good enough for me, can it? <laughs> <laughs> can it? I bet it is. <laughs> That's exactly how it would go. <laughs> take the ring would you rather take the ring to Mordor with Frodo or go through time and space with the doctor? Time and space with the doctor. Fuck yes, I was time punching space. you in your face yeah, when you said Frodo. I'm going to Mordor, man. You are First, you don't like Die Hard. <laughs> then you don't want to hang out with the doctor. I'm not I'm saying I don't want to hang out with the doctor. Why? I'm why are you invited to be saying I'm just saying. I'm just saying of the two, I would rather go to fucking Mordor. You Mordor. think so? <laughs> he, could, he could take you to Mordor and you could watch them do the same thing for three movies. And then walk, yeah. sing, fight. And guess what? There is a bathroom on the TARDIS. Yeah, there is. <laughs> if there's not, well, there was a swimming pool. So yeah, there was a covered. swimming pool, Yeah. <laughs> I don't, I don't fucking want to go nowhere. I can't take a shower. <laughs> exactly. Thank that's you. Why, that's why I don't want to go camping. Yes. Oh my god. Yes. I was like, Chris, why don't you want to go camping? Because I'm goddamn twenty five years old and I'm civilized. That's all. <laughs> why don't you go camping? I don't know because I don't want to sleep in a goddamn cloth house and roll around in dirt for six fucking days. No, I don't want to do that shit. Who the fuck are you going camping for six days? <laughs> that's what I was yeah. thinking. I was like, in a fucking cloth house, bitch. Cool. You're taking me. You no, know, he's taking me. Cody has his fucking you don't cabin. Ever. Go camping. No, with you don't. You don't go camping. With Cody. Like, you're gonna come you, back. You're gonna come back. You ain't. You don't even know. No, you gonna come back. That's why like you don't touch yeah. Bruce Willis's radio. I imagine Bruce Willis just listens to hard rock from the seventies. He does. 
And you don't. You Fuck don't, no. Bruce Willis listens to Lil Wayne. You know it. I doubt he listens you to Lil Wayne. You know it. Bruce, no, Bruce, Bruce Willis listens to Frank Sinatra. I think Bruce Willis listens to, like, Thin Lizzy. I think, Bruce Willis, I think Bruce Willis don't listen to nothing because he's a fucking douche. You shut he don't your like music. mouth. He I doesn't mean, like music. I mean, he's honestly, I mean, I, I imagine Bruce Willis walks around his hat, <laughs> walks around in his house <laughs> with with the fedora. Oh, you're so with, glad with, that you are. With the fedora, <laughs> the a white tux dude. jacket, and the shirt and the tie. No I pants. think he'd be a white tux jacket. Nope. Nothing else. <laughs> no pants. Listen to Frank Sinatra. That's I mean, how I, I walk around my this. house. That's life. Thank you for Taylor being completely different because she'll be behind bars. That's life. Fuck you! <laughs> Fuck you! Oh, oh, she is the Jeffrey Dahmer of Wake Up. Fuck you! Fuck you! Oh my god. When? We ain't even talking about this. <laughs> I know. Ain't nobody got time for that. Oh. <laughs> uh. That's right. Have you <laughs> speaking of that? Have you seen the dental commercial she did? The Ooh. what? <laughs> the sweet bro, a lady who did it away time for that. Yeah. Just, what did a commercial for a local dentist? And she's <laughs> like, oh well, I woke up to go get myself a cold pop, and my <laughs> tooth started hurting, and I'm like, oh Lord Jesus, it's a toothache. And then we get to talk about that. She's like, everybody got time for that. Oh my god. That's like, you know, we, I went to the Chinese restaurant the other day with a couple of friends of mine, and they were like, and it was on a lunch. The, one of the friends was on lunch, and she yeah. has an hour lunch. And I was like, and they're like eating, you know, and I was they're like, hey, there's pudding. And they were like, I don't know if I got time for that. I was like, everybody's got time for pudding. <laughs> Not at the fucking Chinese restaurant, they don't. That shit tastes like they shit it out. Fucking, which two, one is they it? They two girls, one cup. <laughs> they two girls, one cup. That's all it is. I get mad at the old kids. Whatever it is. We had this argument before. Whatever. Yeah, whatever. Whatever. I'm, I'm thinking the first you, two ones. Whatever it is, is it came out of that bitch's ass and she put it in her mouth. Did I tell you what I did? Did I tell you what I did to her? This is a complete dick move and I'm probably going to go to jail if they ever figure out that I did it. So it's probably a bad idea. It's one of like, would you rather fuck over the ignorant Chinese woman or go to jail? And I, I chose. What you did to who? The Dude. lady at the Chinese restaurant. Yeah, the woman who's always on the phone. Yeah. yeah. Oh fuck. She, she, high. she loves me. That must be why she doesn't even look at me anymore. Does we, she not? Well, like, I handed her my debit card and she snatches it out of my hand. I'm like, okay, whatever. She's. They're busy. They're busy. Yeah, I'm the only fucking person here, but they're busy. You know. Well. She swipes it and she throws the card back at me, like literally throws it at my face. What? And I went, "Oh, you fucking bitch!" <laughs> so like I sat there, and the only thing I could think to do, I signed the receipt. Bruce Wayne waited till the next day and called and argued and complained that I got a false charge. <laughs> Holy fuck, <laughs> Bruce Wayne! <laughs> yeah. What's the What's the charge of place to set next to uh, GameStop? Kings Buffet. Kings, yeah. yeah. They, I How do you not remember the name I of that can't, restaurant? I don't eat Chinese food a lot. Anyway. But I really fucking hate their pudding because they lie. The, they if lie? They lie. If there's one thing I fucking love, it's goddamn banana pudding. And you make banana pudding with fucking banana wafers, not goddamn animal crackers. Yeah, but see, that's whoa, the best whoa, part of... Whoa, whoa, whoa. When you say animal crackers, you don't put any vulgarities around it. Goddamn animal crackers. animal crackers. Animal crackers. Animal fucking crackers. It's just, just animal crackers. It's animal you. Crackers. That would be like African. you say you, 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 you listen. You don't make animal pudding. You listen to me. You listen to me. You, you listen to me. You listen to the words that are expunging. <laughs> no, fuck off. My, expunging. They're they're expelling from my vocal cords like no. literary shit. No. You listen. No. Okay. This is no. If you no. say a vulgarity fuck around animal crackers, crackers okay, that's crackers. like me walking in on Robin having no. sex with Batman. You don't fucking get animal crackers. I got nothing against animal crackers. I got shit against animal crackers and banana pudding and another. I don't understand what you don't understand about that rule. You do you talk about animal crackers? You talk about animal crackers. Okay, excuse me, excuse me. I don't know what the fuck they're doing. Putting God shit animal crackers. God shit. In fucking banana pudding. Those two things don't go together. You can't just put any fucking cookies in banana pudding. You can't just like crumble up fucking Oreos hey, and put hey. in banana pudding. Yeah, why not? Oreos. Why can't you? Because there's nothing sacred about banana pudding. There's nothing. Yeah. Uh, they have to sacred yes. about banana pudding. Okay. I bet I could go watch two girls in one cup and get banana pudding. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's chocolate pudding. 
<laughs> Did they use it the Chinese? Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> we come full circle. <laughs> we come full circle. Uh, That's why you rather, could only would do. Would you rather eat banana pudding with animal crackers in it, or a date with Seth and the Slender Man? The lo- the wide man and the Slender Man. <laughs> the the wide man. Smoke it up and go somewhere. The only thing good I fucking can banana pudding. There's no fucking animal crackers in there. The pudding. only thing I can think right now is how much my bladder is rupturing because I have to piss. Go <laughs> pee. No, I can't. The bathroom is over there. I realize it. We are gonna talk so much shit about you while you're no, gone. That ain't even <laughs> the, the microphone is gonna pick me up. No, it's not. Oh no, I'm there whistling. Fuck you, man. Fart. Oh yeah. Is it a fucking symphony when you go in there? We get Sanitation Armies in there. All of a sudden, it's, it's like Bogner's Ride of the Powder. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's Taylor McQueen in the bathroom. Somebody comes in, what's that noise? Oh, Taylor's still fighting his bathroom. Yeah. And that's how you know Taylor's in your house using your bathroom. <laughs> you hear Bobby and Ron the <laughs> Every time she goes to the bathroom. <laughs> without a question. I'm like, I'm standing at work. Where's Taylor? And he goes, <laughs> <laughs> She's in the bathroom. Yeah. I love how every time you go to the bathroom at work, I have to poop. Every time. And I send you like 15 of those poop faces. And you're like, yeah, it feels pretty good. I'm like, bitch, I'm about to shit in this trash can. <laughs> you know what I always tell us every time? Do it. And I send them like 15 poopy faces and a pair of pants. I'm like, I'm going to shit in my pants. Oh my <laughs> and a pair of pants. Oh <laughs> he comes out all smug. And I'm sitting there like, bitch, I'm going to shit. I come out all smug because... So I'm sure Seth can relate. I'm sure Jeremy can relate. Yeah. After you take a good shit, oh man, you feel like you, you how the like, fuck are you gonna take a good one when you have son? Is it not coming out? Oh, wait a minute. I did that so I got no more chicken. I didn't either. <laughs> 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 I'm just a chicken. I'm just a chicken. She's like the Bill Cosby. Oh, no. Every time I feel like I have to poop, you're like, ooh, I gotta go to the bathroom. I'm like, would you gonna be in there 15 minutes? I'm gonna shit on myself. What? I don't even poop the whole time. I know. I hear your phone go off 15 fucking times, and I'm like, I'm gonna shit right here. That's why I start with my butt on silent. I'm all detected. Your fucking butt cheeks are so clenched. I'm shit in butt cheeks. You want to pull out of your pants? got too late to pull out of your ass. You're so clenched, you can't even get a piece of paper for drink now. Chris comes out. I just got 15 fucking new pictures to show me. And I'm like, she's been in there all the time on Facebook and I was about to shit right here. He waits so long to come out, I don't even have to poop no more. <laughs> it's going back up inside. It's waiting. Done. <laughs> don't you hate that? <laughs> I'm fucking like hibernating. And then when you finally have to poop, it's just... Oh, speaking of hibernating. <laughs> oh, shit. I went, to, I went to Sunny's with Zach and Brandy the other night. We were on our way back. We were talking about kids, and Brandy goes, You know, anybody can hibernate and have a kid. Like, bitch, what the fuck did you just say? <laughs> <laughs> Anybody can hire a kid. <laughs> Zach and I start, oh my god, I thought we was going to make her wreck. She was driving. We were laughing so hard. I don't understand. What do you mean, hibernate? What did she say? She was talking about it. I guess she meant fornicate. Can't think of the word. Four- that was two <laughs> words I definitely would have messed she up. She said hibernate, and I was like, Last time, I don't remember hibernating. First. <laughs> <laughs> That's not like, something we got in our fucking shitty ass I love her. I'll think the world of Brandy. That's she what I want. Is. That's what I'm going to start mixing those two words up at random <laughs> moments. <laughs> like, hey, hey, baby, you want to hibernate? <laughs> <laughs> I know. <laughs> After I know. we're done hibernating, we can totally fornicate. <laughs> she, came in the, she came in yesterday. I was like, Brandy, you ready for some hibernation? I'm ready. <laughs> <laughs> Do you think bears cuddle when they hibernate? Fuck no. Fuck no. So? They probably just lay next to each other. Listen, so? if EnviroBear 2000 is any anything to go by, they drive cars, run through lakes, eat fish, and then go out, drive into a cave and hibernate. Why don't we hibernate? That sounds like the best time of my life. <laughs> it does. Oh, I, I think people in Alaska do because it's I dark mean, for six I want to eat of the so year. much. I want to have a butt plug and I want to hibernate. <laughs> but you know that they eat like rocks and sticks and shit, so their yeah. asshole clogs up. 
That is fucking amazing. That's my new favorite one. I did, not, I did not know that they done that. Yeah. Now you know. Like, <laughs> you know what I did know? I the fucking day. And the first thing they do, they act like me when Chris comes out of the bathroom, they run to take a shit. <laughs> <laughs> I, I just read this the other day. If you have eye troubles, like nearsighted or whatever, uh, winter fucking fucks your eyeballs up. Winter fucking fucks my eyeballs up all the time. <laughs> so I'm like, we should just shut everything down and fucking hibernate until spring. <laughs> Fuck yes. Because we're going blind because it's fucking cold outside. Fuck yes. <laughs> my life would be so much better if we could hibernate. The other day, I know. The other day was like the strangest occurrence of winter ever. Was no, no snowing. It, and it, it was because it was hail. Then there was rain. Then there was snow. We had a lot of weather that day. <laughs> With, it within like ten minutes. Sure was a lot of weather out today. And then, and then Reynolds had scheduled extra help that morning, so I was sure it was the end of the world. Oh uh, yeah. <laughs> and then that meteor hit Russia, Russia and the Pope didn't. resigned. The and Pope, lightning struck. The Pope says nope. The Pope says nope. Vatican, more like Vatican. Vatican. <laughs> That's like I'm an American. You are an American. I know I'm an American. I know I'm not an American. I'm an American. I know it. I'm an American. Like, Chris, can you do that? Can't. Sure can't. can't. I'm an American. I love how we have a vague topic that we never fucking stay on, ever. Hey, ever. We'll That's why they're vague. The meaning Eventually. of life. Why don't we just call it Slothcast? More like talk radio. It is more like talk radio. That's all it is, really. I mean, it's really what it is. It's talk radio. But we, we like to give it the guise of having some central point. Yeah. And really, it's more of a, a, a deus ex machina. It's just, it's just something to keep us going. You know, and that's what it is. Like, I can make fun of Seth all day, but eventually everybody's going to get tired of hearing it. Yeah. yeah. Especially so, Seth. Especially <laughs> Seth. <laughs> I'm never gonna Seth goes home and he puts on a record. Oh, by myself. Don't want to be. Oh, by myself. I was <laughs> <laughs> oh, I was just going to offer to come cuddle with you tonight because I'm on with you. And then he said that. And I'm like, bitch, no. Bitch, no. Bitch, no. Bitch, no. Hey, hey, hey. Do you want to picture Bruce Willis? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> what the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? You can just know it ain't that big. And Bruce, and Bruce Willis is sitting there going, <laughs> yeah, Bruce Willis is yeah, like Bruce Willis is like I approve. Yeah, that Bruce Willis look like he's like he's just jerking off to the first Die Hard. Yeah, that, that squinty eyed. Like. Why don't we make videos? It would be so much more funny. Uh, just look at us. I know. <laughs> We're ugly fuckers. We're ugly as shit. Oh man. I don't have video equipment. Believe me, I thought about it. I do think that while we record, somebody should take. You know, footage on their phone that we can upload later on is like a fuck. No, my phone's done got me in enough trouble this year. Hey You're Seth, f- you've got video on your iPhone 4s, don't you? Bitch, don't even start. I'm just asking. Bitch, I'm just asking. You have you have video on your iPhone 4s. Yes. Well, then there you go. I thought you meant like, does he have videos? I'm like, surely he's taking videos of what? <laughs> He's like, Seth's gonna steal his phone. Really, he's like, I mean, Seth's gonna steal his phone. Somebody's gonna, somebody's gonna steal Seth's phone, and they're gonna watch the videos and be like, this is definitely Seth's fucking phone. He's gonna get it taken off his own Facebook page. I just stole his phone from this fat fuck. Look what happened. Puke. <laughs> Fill his mouth a little bit. Think of it. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> scared me. Scared me. I threw it in my mouth. I took it off. I took the set it. jacket off. It was Seth stealing his own phone. I was like, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> That's like some elaborate James Bond shit. Like, steal yeah. your own phone, blame somebody else. I'm going to piss right here. That's what I'm going to Go pee. We'll move the microphone. Fuck no, you. Yeah. No, no. I'm not moving the what? microphone. Just go pee. You bitches are sitting here and be quiet. I'm being quiet. <laughs> this is me. I'm take one of Matthew Bang's Bruce Wells. <laughs> <laughs> Seth, Seth takes photos of Bruce Wells on the internet and photoshops himself into him. This is me and my friend Bruce Wells. <laughs> We're on the set of Die Harder. <laughs> Die Harder. <laughs> This is how I want to die. Oh, I want to die. Oh, I want to die.
<laughs> more Bruce Willis makes it that hard. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> that noise! That. <laughs> Danny, what do you think the meaning of life is? Your hat. My hat is the meaning of life. Your Taylor, hat. what do you think the meaning of life is? Other than that incredible <laughs> shit you just took. This is. I was gonna put that on my head, but it's sweaty. It's hot. Well, like I got this big the, fucking why line. Why are you wearing a hat? Then? Because I. It's my goddamn house. No shit on the toilet. Where <laughs> hell? <all I wanted. laughs> there was shit on the side of the toilet seat. Goddamn, like there was. Side. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> what you doing shit before you even sit down? Sometimes you gotta hover, man. <laughs> I like to think about Bruce Willis about shit. You got, you got one of his shit dies got... hard. <laughs> 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 uh, fuck, fuck our previous talk. We're just gonna talk about Bruce Willis. So fucking I mind. think that every podcast should be about Bruce Willis. <laughs> I'm out. 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 <laughs> You're not even a regular. Out. Fuck you, bitch. <laughs> No, we got it back. We found it. We found oh, it. Yeah. So we got three now after this one. Oh, my one. God. And I'm not cutting the shit out about Joe's penis. Please do it. Oh, no. I'm going to put like a disclaimer like, Taylor Priest loves to talk about Fuck. the cut. <laughs> I don't either. You drug it out of me. I didn't realize we were recording. <laughs> drug it out of you. Dude. I'm not some like Iraqi guard torture expert. Oh, I feel bad. Talking about the penis. Talking about the penis. I feel bad with poor Sam. Everybody's like, Joe's got a micro dick. And I'm like, we really don't, though. <laughs> Try to take it from my brother, man. Don't you know he's twins? <laughs> I like how Taylor's lesbian and resident dick expert. Yeah. <laughs> like, that's like me having a penis and every being a time, Every expert. time I accidentally see a picture of somebody's penis, they're like, what did you think? <laughs> what the fuck do you think I think? It wasn't it's accident. gross. Tell, tell, me, touch it. tell me. Tell me what you think I think. Well, I know, but what do you think? Bitch, I think it's a dick. <laughs> Bitch, I think it's a dick. And I don't want to see it again. Again? <laughs> <laughs> Why did you just go for his gump on someone's dick? Because. I saw it and I was running. Right that was a dollar, dude. Oh. Lieutenant Dan. <laughs> Lieutenant Dan. I want to get a snack name, Lieutenant Dan. Yeah. Because he'll hide the legs. <laughs> I like the look of his face. It's just that subtle, like, goddamn retard. <laughs> Are you retarded or something? Don't you call him a retard. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> I, uh, so Taylor, what mm-hmm. do you think the meaning of life is? I don't, I've had the most fucked up year in my life. I don't even want to answer that question. Okay, so what do you think the most important question in the world is? Would you like fries with that? I think that is the most important guilty. question. Guilty or not guilty, it seems guilty. to be. <laughs> or, uh, if you, if you listen to Lil Wayne, I believe the most important question is, would you like fries with that? I think that that is. <laughs> I mean, I don't know where you guys go. I've never in my life been asked if I wanted fries with that. Really? Never. It's because you're a lesbian. They assume you don't want fries. <laughs> <laughs> Must be. Yeah. Give her the mustard. <laughs> she likes the wedges. <laughs> give, give her something looks like a that's, vagina. That's where you're mistaken, though. Most people in this town think I'm a boy. That's true. <laughs> They're like, that young man you work with? Well, I don't know. What the hell are you talking about? Like, you got to be talking about Taylor, because the only people I work with have been an Anthony. Yeah, it, <laughs> there is one. I mean, she's an older lady. You know, like, probably about in her 50s or 60s. But I swear to God, dresses and everything like a man. Spiky hair? Yeah. I know who you're talking about. Glasses? No. I don't know. Not always wears glasses. Sometimes she does. This one, I mean, she's like gray hair. You know, really yeah. gray hair. And, I mean, not a lot of... Features up front. You must where you be can, talking about her partner. I must be because there's one that comes in the store. Chris calls her sir every time, and like Chris, that is not a guy. But I mean, like even the face. I mean, it's a very, it's a very masculine face. And I made the mistake of saying, you know, what can I help you with tonight, sir? Like that, you know, at the service desk getting her cigarettes, and she was like, "Okay, hey, this look like." And I'm just sitting there thinking, so surprised. Yeah, I, I don't know. I mean, I understand. You, you know, trying to be compassionate to people, but when you dress and act like a man and look like a man, I mean, what do you expect? It doesn't bother me even in the slightest. I mean, that's like... I mean, I've never made that mistake with you. I have all the time. Like Fuck you, Dick. <laughs> <laughs> Though, you know, when Chris did say that he was, him and Seth were going to rub penises with you, I was like, I'm going to fat right now. <laughs> <So> <laughs> right now, right now. <laughs> I was like, that's how... <laughs> 
<laughs> you know, every time somebody says fab, you know what I think, and I don't know why. You remember that's that old rap song? like, I want to rock right now. Yeah. Every time someone says fab, I think, I want to fab right now. <laughs> I want to fab right now. <laughs> and I came to get down. Oh my God. I'm not internationally known, but I'm known to struggle with my bone, you know? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 Oh, it no. takes one to make it all right. <laughs> oh, yeah! That's, isn't that oh, the strangest my. sample they ever have in a song? Oh! Yeah! yeah. <laughs> oh. That's like, does anybody remember Aaliyah? Yeah. You remember yeah. how she had that song, Are You That Somebody? Uh, no, I don't. And there was a sample in the background, I shit you not of a bird. <laughs> Going, oh! What? <laughs> a bird and a baby. I remember, there was, I remember for sure there was a baby because it was like, <laughs> and then like in the video she had like a hawk for just no reason. No like, reason. What the fuck she doing with that hawk? Yeah. And why is there a baby sample? The only thing I think about that after that is, where the fuck do they get these samples? Because I last sample I remember clearly was, oh yeah. <laughs> you fucking know where they get them? They get them from uh, Microsoft Word. You think so? Microsoft Word. I want to do an entire song based off Microsoft sounds. Very <laughs> bad. No, I want, to, I want to make sure it's Vista, too. That way it asks me if I want to do that every time I do it. Yeah. <laughs> Are you sure? Are you sure? You sure? You sure? <laughs> Think about it before you do it. Are you sure? Like the paperclip. Yeah, I miss the paperclip. I yeah. don't. Fuck that. Asshole. Somehow I miss him just because he, he was somebody to talk to. Because yeah. if, if, if I'm sure Seth's the same way, and I know Jeremy is, you know. I like to write, and I... I sit in front of my computer with my word processor open, and it's usually Word or Works, or if I'm, you know, if I don't want to borrow a copy of Word, and yeah. <laughs> you know, when I sit there. Beef. What? Nothing. You play too much Skyrim. <laughs> <laughs> and, you know, and I sit there and I'm typing, and I'm like, it's kind of lonely in here. I mean, I'm getting, man, I really like where this is going, but I'm kind of lonely. My phone's not went off. It's late at night. I don't fucking Just believe me. that for a minute. That my phone's not on? Never. I don't believe that either. And I'm like, and I open the assistant, and there he is. I'm like, hello, paperclip. He's like, what can I help you with? And I'm like, I'm lonely. <laughs> <laughs> and he's like, I'm not that kind of assistant. <laughs> <laughs> like, you think this fun music for turn on the TV or yeah, something? No, he has to get him with paperclip. Like, I kind of wish he was like, I wish they'd revamp him to where he was kind of like Siri. Yeah. You know, and he's like, oh, I'm lonely. It's like, let me find brothels in your area. Yeah. You know? <laughs> yeah. Oh, Jesus Christ. Not a warehouse. It's brothels. Yeah. Brothels. Classy. Classy. Cl- classy. Because yeah. I don't I think... I hate Siri. She's a bitch. Siri is a bitch. I think the most important question in life is, who is Siri's voice? You know who could answer that question? Siri? Google. You think so? Yeah. I thought you were going to say the doctor. I got really excited. <laughs> uh, the doctor is Google. He runs that shit. Why do you think it's such a fun workplace? Why do you let us down so hard? Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> baby. We were waiting for... I've been waiting all evening for someone to start talking about Doctor Who because that's what I really want to talk about. <laughs> You have to wait for somebody to talk about Doctor Who. Yeah, really? because I, cause really? if it was, a, it was, this would be a Doctor Who podcast. If it was up to me, <laughs> there Doctor, are a lot of those. Doctor a lot better Who, than we could do. Yeah, Doctor Who and video games and masturbation. That's what yes. all these podcasts would be about. Like that, it's like when they asking Conan the Barbarian what is best in life. Yeah, Doctor, Doctor Who. Who. Video games, games and, and masturbation. masturbation. <laughs> Those are the three keys to happiness. Yes. <laughs> and when someone asks you the, the question of life of how can you be happy, Doctor Who's. Doctor Who's. Because there's, <laughs> Who's there's a there question. Before. Yeah. <laughs> well, no, it's like, whose is that? Yeah. Like, <laughs> Doctor Who's. <laughs> Doctor Who's. <laughs> to Doctor <laughs> Whom it may concern. <laughs> Doctor Who it may concern. Oh, Doctor <laughs> Who. Masturbation and video games, and that is prioritized. Yes, <laughs> like, prioritized. Doctor Who is first, and then play with your willy a little bit. <laughs> no, no, you, uh, video games, and then masturbate. No, I, I. You play with willy on video games? <laughs> <laughs> what kind of video games do you play, Chris? The same ones as set watches. Those sick, <laughs> sick games from Japan. Yeah, it's like the. the Panty Sniffer 7 from Japan. <laughs> <laughs> I'm watching play though. Yeah. <laughs> and, and it says like, you know what this game's missing? And I'm like, more panties? And he's like, who's worse? <laughs> exactly. Oh, God. God damn, I wish I was Bruce Willis. <laughs> I can't wait. For Taylor to go to the bathroom the next time we're at work together. So I'm just going to go, da 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 da
Oh god! And I can hear it. I'll, you'll be able to hear it from behind the door. Oh damn it, Chris! <laughs> So we've established that the meaning of life and what to make you happiness in this podcast is Doctor Who, video games, and masturbation. It's true. I mean, that is great because I don't have any of those three things in my life. <laughs> yeah. like, Doctor Who's on like Netflix, man. Yeah. I don't even have the internet except for on my phone. I'm not watching Doctor Who on my phone. Why not? Why not? I do it work all the time. Yeah. On third shift? I'm, th- I'm on third shift? I watch the shit out of some Doctor Who. <laughs> I mean, what else are you gonna do on your phone? Huh? That's true. I mean, you can't text your girlfriend. Chris, we're not gonna talk about this. <laughs> why? Why are we ragging on this poor girl? Because she doesn't like Bruce Willis. <laughs> what part of that were you not here for? The he doesn't like. like in the podcast. I come over crying. He's like, it's gonna be okay. Tate. It's gonna be alright. I'm crying. And then fucking in here, he's like, fuck you. Can't text your girlfriend. I gotta go to jail. <laughs> fuck you. Oh fuck any fuck. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Because this is a comedic, apparently, talk radio show. Yeah, plus the podcast. I mean, I can't. Talk, talk, talk okay, no, no, no. This is, I can't. Talk cast. Sloth cast is a talk radio podcast. There you go. We should be on NPR. We, I, this I'd is probably my... go to jail just by what Chris just said. <laughs> you know, because the cops, they That's watch. you're called, uh, uh, what, Rover? Snatch Rover? Snatch, Snatch Rover. Snatch Rover, yes. So we've decided this is more. Oh my fucking radio. god, Seth! You can't go into Walmart and say that anymore. Do you? you can't do it. You can't say snatch rover. No, you can't say that. Can't do it. Can you say snatch rover? I can't say snatch, snatch rover though. Anytime he says snatch rover, it does the same effect. They know who it is. Yeah. They will know. They'll be like snatch rover, and they should just lay down like search me. I'm curious. Search me. Curiosity. <laughs> Did you get that picture I sent you earlier? Of what? Of what I feel is the doctor's mother. Did you get it? Yes, I got it. That theory has been presented before. It was printed shortly after the show premiered. See, I never thought about it. I never thought about it. Did they ever disprove it? Not yet. I don't think so. So there's a good possibility it is the doctor's mother. Are you talking about the revamp series? Yeah, the revamp series. Well, they never showed his mother in the original, did they? Not that I know. Not in the episodes I've seen. I always assumed that, much like Seth, the doctor was hatched. Well, hatched. Yeah. Well, that's what my grandma always told me. Buzzard shit me on the rock and the, the sun hatched me. Buzzard shit Fuck, you I on the rock. Fuck, I believe that. Look at you. <laughs> <laughs> you look like somebody shit you on a Fuck rock. Fuck you, <laughs> Chris. No, I, I just got like this vision of like 2001 A Space Odyssey. You know, with like <clears throat> the monolith and everything and it's just the egg. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, you see like one uh, fucking blonde hair pokes out. <laughs> but it's from my ass. It's from my ass. <laughs> <laughs> you know a hairy ass? Yes, yeah. I do. I'm proud, son. It's blonde and it's soft. <laughs> Did I tell you? You, it? It? you said, watch it? Yes, yes, I do. <laughs> Like, oh yeah, oh yeah. She comes her ass every time. Bluffs it up. My mom, home. every time, every time, if I bring somebody over, mom goes, you know what? I'm like, bitch, don't do it. Don't do it. She <laughs> says, when you were born, you had the hairiest ass I've ever seen on a kid. And you still do. <laughs> and you still do. <laughs> At least it's not like our parents. You know what my mom says one of the first things? I got pictures of him naked in the tub. <laughs> it's oh, like, yeah. Mom, don't show him that. It didn't get much next. bigger. But I'm always proud of those. Those are my cute moments. Now I take my clothes off and get in the tub. Bitch is like, <laughs> It's like, uh, and anytime I leave my mother with a woman, I'm just like, guys, don't talk about my awkward years. You know, birth through now. Yeah. <laughs> birth through this. Yeah. Talk about my potential that I will never, never feel. Yeah. Talk about, let's talk about just how smart and how much of a sweetheart I am while I'm in the other room baking cookies and burning myself on the other. <laughs> <You know? laughs> well, my, my dad, all, his, his opening line is, don't worry, we're not related. <laughs> oh, God. Uh, I didn't know your dad, that's his pickup line, too. Yeah. Like, before I met your mom, he was in Germany, like, don't worry, we're not related. <laughs> but we're going to kid together, too. <laughs> I actually talk about that German whore. <laughs> I said that's sex actual mother. <laughs> wait, 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 wait a minute. I just missed that. What did you just say? <laughs> His dad banged a German whore. 
Oh, I thought you said I'd have sex with your mother. I thought that's what you said. How did I get that? <laughs> Actually, she said eagerly like, hey, wait, what? <laughs> Actually, <laughs> Seth's mother and I are I am supposed to get a sex change and run off with Seth's mother. Holy fuck. <laughs> Why do you have to get a sex waiting. change? Yeah. Why would not be a sex change? Women are awesome. No, they fucking are. Yeah, they are. No. Hey, I'm just saying, I mean, if I had a vagina, I'd just sit there and play with myself in front of a mirror all day. That's what you think. I would. They, I don't think having a vagina is some fun, happy time. It's not. It fucking sucks. That, you, no, it fucking sucks. You know what? What? It's not my fault that it's Shark Week for you, okay? Shark Week? <laughs> it's fucking Shark Week! <laughs> Fucking shark week. I'm just a cunt all the time. <laughs> fucking God, shark week. I fucking figured that out real quick. Fucking shark week. Hey, hey. When we were little kids, I'm like, Danny, will you pass the ketchup? And she's like, Die, faggot! I'm like, She's three. Die, three, baby. Do you don't lie to a bitch, she? I'm gonna spit in your ass. <laughs> Do you remember when we were little? I you know. had two TVs and you had the fucking remote. Jesus God, she's got long fingernails. Yeah, my toenails are longer. I'm like, fucking anyway. I need to cut those. those <laughs> that's that just today. disgusting. Don't put, don't put those near my table. What the? <laughs> I take naps under that table. You yeah, know. I do too. Several. Why? What? Why? Because it's good. That's I understand Sarah Taylor. She has a lot of problems. You? Oh, no, I do. I've got a lot of problems. You, you have a bed. <laughs> yeah, but a rent. You were raised better than that. <laughs> no, I wasn't. Oh, yeah, that's Think right. about our parents. Oh, yeah, we had, <laughs> our we had to have bed frames until we were, like, 13. Yeah, that's why I can't have a bed frame now. Like, and I then was, eventually we were just like, fuck this, this is what I didn't, Bitch, I didn't even have a room until I was, like, 10, and well, I'm an only child. That's because you tried to reenact Les Miserables every day as a child. <laughs> <laughs> that's not our culture, weird, and you don't like Bruce Willis. Fuck you. It's not, it's not, you know, you can't blame anyone for the fact that you didn't have a room except for yourself. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, even your you astronaut egg laid by a vulture. Right? Yeah. Because I'll tell you right I'm now. I'm an astronaut egg laid by a vulture. <laughs> 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 I'm an astronaut egg. I'm an the hell on top of this big ass white egg. I'm a fucking doctor. That's all there is to it. That, yeah. I just don't know it yet. You're, you're the next doctor. That's I what. fucking hope so. I really hope that Craig Ferguson's the next doctor. I Man, I know it'll never happen. That's wishful thinking. That'd be like. Has Anna. he even done any serious roles? Yeah. Not Overseas. <laughs> Overseas. <laughs> you know, me thinking that maybe Craig Ferguson or Cillian Murphy become the doctor is about the same possibilities as Anne Hathaway breaking down out here and being cold and wanting to have sex for warmth. <laughs> <laughs> it's not going to happen. I'm Shrewsbury. Yeah, I'm Shrewsbury. Shrewsbury. A, it sounded fancy. On a derelict road in a derelict town yeah. in the and least right. populated and you town. And you just hear it in here. You just, just a faint, just, oh God. And Chris is like, Anne Hathaway. I, I heard just that, know. I heard that bitch. I heard that bitch. I heard that bitch. I heard that bitch. I fucking yeah. love that you little bitch, okay? That's my favorite word. <laughs> I love that. No, no. See, I love that. If more people listen to this podcast, how much shit we would get into for saying "bitch," but it's okay if Taylor done it. No, <laughs> fuck. I don't know about now. Everybody's gonna listen to it. I'll fucking be in court. Oh, I can't say that on here. That'd be, anyways. It'd be Snatch Rover. Bitch, bitch, Snatch bitch, Rover. Bitch, 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 bitch. <laughs> Anytime Taylor Snatch says something that might get her sent to jail, we're just gonna use a clip of Jeremy going "Snatch Rover." <laughs> <laughs> hey, everybody, be quiet so he can just say "Snatch Rover." <laughs> Snatch Rover. There we go. Yeah, there we go. Not, and it's a, <laughs> now I, I want to put that at the end of them, too. I can snatch that. Rover. I, I gotta go to Snatch Rover tomorrow. <laughs> yeah. uh, uh, we need a serious conversation after this is over. <laughs> <laughs> There's no way we can have a serious conversation in I this building. I hope not, because I'll probably cry. <laughs> <Y'all> probably. <laughs> Sad eyes, turn the air. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, I think we have ex- uh, burned through our time. Uh, we're at 57 minutes. 57 yeah, 57 minutes. minutes. Holy shit. Uh, you might as well just length it out and go for a full hour. I mean, uh, 57 we got minutes. Three minutes. What are we going to talk about? Time, would you rather. Just, let's do another would you rather. Would you rather. Who, haven't, who uh, hasn't done a would movie? Would you rather yet? watch a movie with no subtitles or audio or only listen to the audio from a movie with no picture? Holy fuck. Audio. Audio. Audio, no picture. Audio, no picture. Audio. Yeah. Audio. Audio, yeah. no picture. Would you rather walk in on me having sex with Anne Hathaway or me having sex with Sam? Sam! 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 Nope. 
<laughs> nope. Nope. <laughs> nope. 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 I guess. I oh, guess. I do have I like a little crush on Anne Hathaway if I want to. I do. I do. And I know, if I want to don't have sex with her, I at least get to see her naked, so Anne Hathaway. It, it's not just a gay crush. for any, It's a, just a, an okay crush for anyone to be obsessed with Anne Hathaway. Oh, yeah. Like, my she's phone. She's so lovely. My I'm phone. I'm sure she's used to it by now. Yeah. Uh-huh. I'm pretty sure, like, she walks down the red carpet, there are just panties getting thrown at her. Panties! <laughs> fucking panties! <laughs> Taylor's like, Taylor's like, I gotta one-up that! So she, like, <laughs> reaches back and pulls out one of her fucking long, blonde ass panties. <laughs> Oh, so, one of these days I'm going to come in here and you're going to feel my ass and, oh, you're, gonna, uh, and you're going to fall in love with me bitch you will you just <laughs> shut up oh, 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 oh. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. she's going to have on the side she's going to have a jerry oh, oh, oh. oh, oh. she's going to be like Pat <laughs> She's gonna have an ass cornrows. We're <laughs> gonna fucking be in love. It's, because that's what gets them every time. They ain't sure. Until they feel my ass. And then they're totally in the woods. You know, do you know what made me fall in love with you, Taylor? What? You pulled out your pants and Bruce Willis was your vagina. <laughs> 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 I'm Chris, this is Seth, Taylor, Danny, Bash Patch Adams, this has been the third episode of the Slothcast. We'll see you guys next week when we just go ahead and admit that we are just talk radio. <laughs> <laughs>